Okay, if you ever have to add up a big column of numbers, the big problem is just keeping everything in your head. And so there's little tricks you can do that will uh, avoid that, okay? So I'm just going to demonstrate, and then I'll talk about it as I go through. Okay, so let's start over here. If I take 1 and 7 is 8, and 5 is 13, okay? I'm going to put a little dot right there for the 10. It's 13 is 10, and the 3 left over. So I'm basically dropping my 10s as I come to them. Then I'll come back and pick them up later, okay? So 7 and 1 is 8, and 5 is 13. I drop the 10, and I keep the 3. So 3 and 8. 8 and 3 is 11. I drop the 10, keep the 1. 1 and 6 is 7, and 5 is 12. I drop the 10 and keep the 2. 2 and 2 is 4, and 7 is 11. So I'll just keep the 1, and 3 is 4. And I write the 4 down here. Now, 10, 20, 30, 40. Put that up here. That's the carry. Now, let's do the next column. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Drop it all. 9 and 3 is 12. Drop the 10 and keep the 2. 2 and 3 is 5 and 4 is 9 and 6 is 15. Drop it and keep the 5 and 2 is 7. And there's 10, 20, 30. So there's a 3 that I want to carry. 4 and 3 is 7 and 1 is 8. And 5 is 13. Keep the 3, 4, 5, and 5 is 10. Drop everything. 7 and 2 is 9, and 3 is 12. And so I'm going to drop the 10, because all the other 10s have been dropped, and put the 2 here. Now, 1, 2, 3 is what I carry. So 3, 4, 5, 6, and 5 is 11. And so take the 1 and the 4 is a 5. And there's only one drop, so that's the right there. Okay, 15,274 uh, with uh, fairly high reliability, and you don't have a lot of big numbers to carry in your head. You unload the tens as you come to them and keep the rest. Okay, that's it. It's just a simple trick. If you ever need to add columns and numbers, I recommend uh, this method.